When the day of Pentecost came, they were all together in one place. Suddenly a sound like the blowing of a violent wind came from heaven and filled the whole house where they were sitting. They saw what seemed to be tongues of fire that separated and came and rest on each of them. All of them were filled with the Holy Spirit and began... What are you doing, Pastor? I am ready for this week's video. I've got everything that we need. Everything that we need? We yeah. have everything we need. I've just shared the passage. I know, but I was thinking we could liven things up a little bit this week. We could have some special effects. Look. Special look, effects? Yeah. First of all, I found these really cool things. Okay. So what first of all, because you think about it. They're praying, they're in this room, and suddenly, listen to this, the wind, the violent wind comes in. And look, we can even have this wind. Well, my hair might help a little bit with that. And then, as they're coming, tongues of fire, and we can have the fire behind us and brewing. Isn't that perfect? Well, I have a little bit of a concern with wind, here. fire, hair. But nonetheless, oh, well, maybe you should be more concerned with mine. Oh, stop it! You are livening things up as we speak, Pastor Wendy. I, I, bye, bye. It, it's great to reenact it. Truth be told, it's the spirit that livens things up. I know, but I want everyone to realize the impact of this day, the birth of our church. It's it's a high holy festival. It is such a great day, and, and I fully agree that. We need to understand the impact of this day. But it's a spirit that livens things up. And the best way we reenact that is when we gather together as the church. Because in our gathering, the spirit enlivens us and sends us into the world to do the work of God together. Yeah, I guess you're right. So we need people for our special effects, right? Absolutely. So can we get the tiki torches? I think we'll leave the tiki torches outside for this day. But nonetheless, I, I, I agree. We need the people. So join us Sunday. Experience Pentecost. Experience the presence of the Holy Spirit as we are enlivened by its presence and sent forth into the world to proclaim the good news that he who died was raised and to do that work that he did for all the world in all our days. Ugh. See you Sunday. I can't wait. Thank <laughs> you.